السلام علیکم ٹوڈے اور ٹاپک از ڈفی بلڈ گروپ سسٹم ان دس ویڈیو آئی ول ایکسپلین ان ڈیٹیل واٹ از ڈفی بلڈ گروپ سسٹم اٹس اینٹیجنس اینٹی باڈیز جینیٹکس اینڈ اسپیشلی دا جینیٹکس آف نل فینو ٹائپ دس ویڈیو از گوئنگ ٹو بی ویری امیزنگ سو میک شور ٹو واچ دس ویڈیو ٹل دا اینڈ ڈفی بلڈ گروپ سسٹم واز نیمڈ آفٹر دا ڈسکوری آف ڈفی اینٹی باڈیز ان مسٹر ڈفی اینڈ دا لاسٹ ٹو لیٹر آف مسٹر ڈفی نیم ور ٹیکن to represent this blood group system. So first of all, I am going to discuss the antigens of Duffy blood group system. Its antigens are expressed on red blood cell surface. It has two important antithetical antigens. We call them FYA and FYB. Antithetical antigens are actually those antigens which are expressed by different alleles of a single gene. Alleles are the variable form of a single gene. I will explain this point later. This blood group system also has some other antigens. We call them FY3, FY5 and FY6. Among these antigens, FYA and FYB are important. So our focus will be on these antigens. And also remember that Duffy blood group system antigens are also expressed on other body cells such as brain, endothelium, lungs, colon and kidney cells but these antigens are not expressed on white blood cells and platelets now i will discuss the biochemistry of duffy blood group system antigens so this is red blood cell membrane and the duffy antigen are expressed on a glycoprotein and its length is 338 amino acids or 336 amino acids the c terminal of this glycoprotein is inside the red blood cell while the N terminal is outside the red blood cell. We call this glycoprotein DARC or we call it Duffy antigen receptor for chemokine. It has clinical significance. I will discuss the clinical importance of Duffy blood group system in a separate video. You can find the link of this video in description. Now first we will discuss where FYA and FYB antigen are present on this glycoprotein. So amino acid number 42 decides that which type of antigen will be expressed. If glycine is expressed on this place, then FYA antigen will be present on this glycoprotein. And if aspartic acid is expressed on 42 number, then it will make FYB antigen on this glycoprotein. But remember, Only this single amino acid is not the whole antigen, but this amino acid decides whether it is FYA or FYB antigen on Duffy glycoprotein. Now let's talk about another antigens. FY6 is also present on N terminal. An amino acid from 31 to 40 makes the FY6 antigen, while FY3 antigen is present on third loop of glycoprotein. If we count, this is first loop, this one is second and it is the third loop. If we treat FYA and FYB antigen with proteolytic enzymes, these antigens will be destroyed. So these antigens are proteolytic enzyme sensitive, while FY3 antigen is resistant because it is not degraded when we treat this antigen with proteolytic enzymes. Now we are going to explain the genotype of Duffy blood group system. The genes of Duffy blood group system reside on chromosome number 1. These genes are present on long arm. We represent the Duffy gene with FY or capital FY. This gene has two important alleles known as FYA and FYB. When FYA allele is present on chromosome number 1, FYA antigen will express on this Duffy glycoprotein and keep in mind FY3 antigen will also express with FYA antigen. Similarly, if FYB allele is present, then FYB antigen will express on Duffy glycoprotein and FY3 antigen will also present. So whether it is FYA or FYB antigen expression, FY3 will always present. But if both of these antigen FYA and FYB are not expressed, simply we can say if this glycoprotein is not expressed, 
f y 3 will also not present let's elaborate this point further while explaining the null phenotype in some individuals the recessive duffy gene is present which is represented by just f y this mutated gene is mainly expressed in african population the coding portion of gene remains normal but for motor region which control the expression of this gene is mutated actually the g a t a sequence in promoter region is mutated in these individuals so transcription factors are not attached with the promoter region and it will stop the expression of fy gene and keep in mind it is very 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 important point this is mutated form of fy b allele so fy b allele is mutated in africans that's why africans are unable to produce duffy glycoprotein i will explain it further now explore the phenotype of african population as i told you earlier african have mainly mutated fyb allele so on red blood cells duffy glycoprotein will not express that's why these individual will not have fyb and fy3 antigen on red blood cells but african population express duffy glycoprotein on other body cells as i told you earlier this blood group system antigen express on brain lungs etc so fyb and fy3 antigen will express on these cells while in white population recessive allele is very very rare and with different mutation as compared to africans this mutation result in loss of expression of duffy glycoprotein on both the red blood cells and other body cells so white population do not express any of the duffy antigens like fyb fya and fy3 antigen now it's time to explain the distribution of antigens and antibody of duffy blood group system let's say if an individual has fya and fya genotype it means both of the chromosome one from mother and one from father has fya allele so this individual has fya antigen on red blood cell surface and fyb antigen is not present on red blood cell this individual will make the anti fyb antibody but he cannot make anti fya antibody due to negative selection so keep in mind in blood group system if an individual has some particular antigen he will not develop antibodies against it like if you have a antigen in a b o blood group system you cannot produce anti a antibody so if an individual has fyb fyb genotype mean both of the chromosome have fyb allele then he will express only fyb antigen that's why he can make anti fya antibody and if you are heterozygous mean both of the allele fya and fyb allele are present then this individual will express both of the antigen fya and fyb so due to negative selection none of the duffy antibodies will produce all of the antibody in duffy blood group system are igg in nature but cannot activate the complement system let's move to the most important point of this topic if an individual has recessive gene on both of his chromosome and his red blood cell express neither fya nor fyb antigen then what is the antibody distribution in this individual so here are two possibilities as i explained earlier if he is african he will not express duffy glycoprotein on red blood cell surface but he can express this duffy glycoprotein on other body cells and you know it is mutated form of fyb gene so he can express fyb and fy3 antigen on other body cells but he cannot express fyb and fy3 antigen on red blood cell so overall we can say this person has fyb and fy3 antigen but fya antigen is not present in this person 
so due to negative selection only anti fya antibody will produce in this person but in wide population there is other type of mutation where duffy glycoprotein is not expressed both on red blood cells and other body cells so all of the antigens fya fyb and fy3 will not present in the whole body that's why this person will produce all the three types of antibodies anti fya anti fyb and anti fy3 i hope this video will be helpful if you like this video please consider subscribing my channel and also share my channel with your friends thanks